And now we are doing something that we have never done before. Well, she has not done before. No. Now we're just trying to find everybody. We gotta get it ready for winter and just got it getting too cold. So today we woke up and it was about 28 degrees. A lot of ice on the deck and the car, but still it's not too bad. So so right now we are on our way to take Devin on a Boy Scout event. And then after that we are going to head down to Delta. We're going to meet up with a bunch of friends and go on a small church fishing trip. So I'm going to take you along. But first, I'll let Devin talk to you about his Boy Scout event. I am off to my Boy Scout event. It is called the Freeze Up Canoe Race, which we are going to drop the canoes into the Chino River. Into the Chino River. And we are going to float for, if, if you're slow, four hours, but if you're fast, then two hours. We did this a little bit ago in the summer, but that one took nine hours. And this one is actually a race between different troops. So, <sighs> Troop 42, my troop, has a record, I would say. They have not lost in a long time so I'm hoping we'll be able to get first place and see what see what happens.
I finished my canoe race. It was a lot of fun. I was in the back of the canoe, so that was hard, but it was just super fun. My, um, my friends in the canoe, we all worked hard. Um, in our group, we got four, we got second place. My friend, my friends got, um, first place. So, it was a lot of fun. And can't wait for next year. So, the boys came back from the canoe race. And now we are doing something that we have never done before. Well, she has not done before. No. So, our church is driving to Delta Junction. So all those people drive out there with their campers or they're bringing tents and they're spending the weekend there. They go fishing and they make a fire at night. They just hang out, right? Mm -hmm. Form new friendships and just have a good time and then Sunday mornings they have a worship in the wilderness mm -hmm. and then everybody goes back home for some odd reason the last couple of years we could never go right yeah. there was always something so this year we said you know what let's do this let's be adventurous and let's go out there and this is our last 2019 adventure in the RV so yes so when we signed up for it, we did not know that it was this cold. And this morning it actually started to snow. It's still snowing a little bit. It's still snowing a little bit. So we're still going to do this. We're braving the cold, right? Mm -hmm. It is 33 degrees right now. Um, good thing we have a camper. Good thing we have a heater that's working. Mm -hmm. I'm excited. I'm a little bit nervous about the cold. I think she's more nervous than excited. Yes. Yeah. I am a little bit nervous about it. But I think it's going to be fun. You guys pack the fishing gear, yeah. right? Mm -hmm. Maybe we will catch some last salmon. Are they good salmon to eat? Uh, good to smoke. Last silver salmon. But they're they're near their, their run. They're about to die. About to spawn and die. Because so. they went all the way up to Fairbanks right well they went yeah so they traveled from the Pacific Ocean all the way up to um, where the Yukon River uh, where the Yukon River touches the, 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 the Berlin Sea so then he traveled up the Yukon River and then they turned and went up to Tanana River and so now they are going up to Clearwater so they they've been They've been traveling a lot. Mm -hmm. And clear water is where we are heading right now. Yep. made it out here to the park now we're just trying to find everybody and Devin is ready to slay some salmon in there right yep. and actually this is the first place this is the place where Devin caught his first salmon so and heard the catching is good let's see what happens
no luck with the fish. So we heard that the fish actually came in a couple of weeks ago because they started to run really early in the season, but it was still fun to be out there. But now it's getting cold, so we start in a fire. <laughs> So I came inside just to warm up. Emily has been in here for the entire time. She's been reading, look at the camera, all the condensation. And yet I don't regret it. Yeah, because we had the camera outside and it was so cold and now I brought it in. All the condensation is on the lens. Yeah, she says she has no regrets. She loved her reading time here. We were sitting by the fire, but now I just had to make myself a warm cup of tea. <sighs> just to warm up for a little bit. Look, there is still all that condensation. <sighs> I don't know why, but I'm just not ready for this winter this year. I don't know what it is. It, but it's that wet cold that just gets straight to your bones you know normally once when we once when the snow um is on the ground and the sun is normally out you have that really dry cold and you can handle that but that wet cold is just ah uh, i don't know it just gets to you so john is out there with the kids um he's cooking in the dutch oven and we're starving. Emily and I, we have been eating the noodles and stealing and snacking a couple things. So yeah, don't tell him. So dinner's done. We are now chowing down. And then later on tonight, we might do some s'mores. I don't know, sit around by the campfire, hang out, socialize, and uh, I would like to get a good night's rest. So we'll see. So. Dinner was really good. Um, we are now going to have a great party out there. We're going to have s'mores and then we're going to be with them. We finished food. It was really good. And... <laughs> oh, jeez. We finished food, it was really good, and now we're gonna meet up with everybody. <laughs> we finished, no. We finished food now, and now we're gonna. Oh, 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 we finished. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> we <laughs> We've we finished eating, it was really good, and now we're gonna go outside and have s'mores and everything, and we're wrapping it up for this vlog. See you up north. <laughs>